Dylan, just kind of take me through the weekend. What did you enjoy about it? I'm just uh, reconnecting with my old coaching staff, being around the guys, and not really even talking football, just getting back and um, talking, just, just, talk, just catching up, catching up, basically. What was kind of their message to you about the role you could play and you know, why they need a guy like you? Um, just uh, just uh, need another fast guy. Um, just uh, just to add on to what they have already. Um, they already have a lot of good receivers. Um, it's not it's uh, it's always good to you know get better. You, you visited Ole Miss. You visited Tennessee. You, both those offenses, you know, mm -hmm. is, is that a big reason why you, those are like kind of near the top of your list? Just because it, it would wouldn't take as much to kind of integrate yourself into you know everyday life at those places. Exactly. Um, I want to. I, I always when I enter the airport, I want to go somewhere where I was comfortable or. Just some, and that's even like taking the visit back home to TCU. Um, I, I know those coaching staff, and I'm comfortable there. I'm comfortable uh, with Ole Miss's um, uh, offense, and I'm comfortable with uh, Coach Hype's offense as well. What, what do you like about Coach Hype, and what did, what did you think of you know Kelsey Pope this weekend? I love Kelsey Pope. Um, he was uh, he had more energy than I expected him to have. Um, real uh, fun guy, uh, outgoing. Um, um, I know he's gonna he's gonna push me. I feel like he'll give me be a, bit, a good push as a coach. You see Cedric Tillman, they've added Brew McCoy. You're different than those guys. Mm -hmm. do, you, do you feel like you know you, you could add something to Tennessee's offense that you know you know kind of pick up on what Bayless did at the end of last year? Oh, for sure. Um, those are some some bigger guys. So uh, come if I did come here, you know, um, got big dudes in front of me blocking, so I wouldn't be you know I wouldn't I wouldn't mind all that. Um, and Cedric, uh, he's a he's a vet now. You know, he, he put up good numbers, and it's always good to have help. What do you I guess what, what's the best thing Tennessee's got going for right now? Just the way they're moving, uh, Tennessee. I think is going in the upward direction. Um, beginning a lot of good dudes coming in, and um, last year, first time offense, uh, first time coaching staff, they did real good. And I know second year is they're up to do something great. You, you look at the schools that you know are at the top of your list. Tennessee's probably the most stable at quarterback with a returner guy, with a returning guy like Hendon Hooker. Uh, did you have much interaction with him this weekend? Oh yeah, I met with uh, Hendon. We had a uh, good talks. He's a uh, real good dude. And just where do things stand now? Do you have, a, have still have a decision to make, and do you have any more visits planned, or what? Uh, kind of still have a still have a decision to make. Um, haven't decided yet on if I'm taking any more visits or if I am. Um, Y'all might see something soon. Um, I'm just gonna go home, uh, sit on it, relax, and just get my mind off of things. Been a lot of traveling lately. What, what will be the you know when, when you and your family sit down to work towards a decision? Is it is it you or is it the, the collective effort or and what will be important for you? Uh, just I got six months. You know uh, that's the plan and. Uh, Wherever I can go in six months, and it'd be the best me. So what, what's the biggest thing, that, or what, why do you, are you looking at Tennessee? What's the main reason? Is it this staff and just the familiarity, or uh, something else about Tennessee? Uh, Tennessee as a school, you know, Tennessee is the big leagues. Um, you know, I think I got a lot to, uh, to prove, and I think Tennessee, Ole Miss, and the other uh, TCU, all the other schools that I have interest in, I think those are the schools I'm, I'm trying to get to that bigger stage and prove that I can do it on any level. No leader in your mind right now or anything like that? Not right now. Yeah.